All right, so we have the Engine Star. This is the R300 Portable Power Station. This thing is really, really cool. I'm a sucker for a good portable power station, especially the ones within this kind of price range and this price point. They are much more affordable than a lot of the other ones that basically are gonna cost like half your paycheck or even your whole paycheck, depending on how you work. Uh, but this, these ones are actually perfect in an emergency. They do come, this one comes with two normal outlets. And if you plugs are, do you have the third grounded plug? You can actually still plug them in, which is something I like. No, they're not actually gonna be grounded, but you can still plug them in. We have a USB type C port, uh, two USB five volt ports, these are 3.1A. And I like like this one, this one they did something different. A lot of times the input, so this can be charged up three different ways. You can do it with your car, which they do include the plug here, and you can use your outlet. And once again, they include the plug here. I love that they include those plugs. Or you could get um, some solar panels uh, and have the solar panels plugged in here. But a lot of those, you're gonna have to turn around and like the input is on the back. But for this one, it's all right here on the front which I actually kind of like that because that's going to make cable management a, a lot easier. You're not going to have to worry about this being backed up against a wall. And the other reason why you're not going to have to worry about this being backed up against the wall is because the fans that output the air are on both sides. The vents are on both sides. So that's actually really cool that they did that. Um, my only complaint is I wish they had like a cover for the car outlet here. But it's neither here nor there. It just kind of is what it is at this point in time. So with this, you're going to have the power button here. That's going to turn all of these on. And you actually don't need to. This is the other difference between this one and a lot of the other ones. There is no button to turn on these ports right here or even this one right here. All you have to do is plug something in. And as soon as you plug something in, it's going to tell you on the screen. I hope the screen doesn't keep flashing uh i don't know if it's flashing like that on the recording uh, but in real life it's not doing that it's very solid so let's plug in my airpods here all right so we plugged in my airpods obviously they're not going to be taking a lot of juice but you can see now here we're using 1.5 to 1.6 watts to charge up my AirPods. And if I plugged in my phone, it would be a lot more as well, right? But I didn't have to press a button to turn on these ports like you would normally. You do have to obviously press the power on. Now for the AC, you do have to turn that on and you might even hear the fan when I do that. So the fan did kick in to start blowing out air to turn the AC on. And now you can see we have the AC up here. And if I plug something in, it would tell you how many watts were being used there. So we're gonna unplug that. All right, now the only other thing with this is this does have a light. Uh, all of these uh, portable power bank, portable power station companies, they like to put a light on these. And this light happens to be on the back here. You just kind of turn it on and it has different modes, like different SOS modes, rave mode, I guess, there. And they put this one on the back instead of on the side or the same as the front. But the Engine Star Portable Power Station, this thing is pretty cool. Um, I can't wait to actually get to really test this out out in the woods. But so far, I'm liking what I'm seeing. I like the portability of it. It's super easy to carry. And this is just, this is like in the price range and the size wise that this is much more accessible and much more reasonable for uh, your average person to have in case of an emergency. Uh, you know, you're really not gonna have to worry about charging up your phones for a while, uh, especially with most modern phones, if you, if you have this fully charged up. So I'm excited to have it and I'm excited to start using it and testing it with some other stuff.